Hello and welcome to Shipboard Flight Operations in the DCS Huey. And let's jump right in with some theory. Alright, so helicopters are pretty versatile, so they can take off and land in a variety of conditions on the ship. But of course the ship wants to make the helicopter's job as easy as possible. So the OOW on the bridge is going to try to create RET 20 with 30. That means from the port side, that's the left side of the ship, 20 degrees, 30 knots of wind. That's the ideal conditions for the helicopter to take off and land. Why the wind 20 degrees offset to the left? Well, because on almost all ships there's a huge hangar bay right in front of the flight deck. So if you have the wind straight from the front, you're going to have a wind shadow right on the flight deck where you need the wind the most. In our scenario right here, we got northwesterly winds with around 10 knots, so the OOW picked a call of 360 with 20 knots to create the wind 30 knots, port 20 degrees. That means that even though the real wind is only 10 knots from the northwest, when we stand on the flight deck or hover next to it, matching the speed of the ship, the relative wind to us is going to be 30 knots out of 340. All right, let's get going. Ships on flying course and speed, fences down, we get green deck. So we're just gonna pick her up, check that everything is in the green. Then we slowly hover to the port side into position so we get the full wind onto our nose. And again, stay in position, check that everything is all right, and then we can get going. As you can see, takeoff isn't too much of a problem with 30 knots already going over your blades. Now we can go get some beer and some chips from the shops and return back to the ship. Alright, there's the ship back inside. Now we're going to approach it from the aft, uh, but we're not going to aim directly for the ship. We're going to aim for a position slightly to the left of the flight deck. We want to hover where we hovered just before we got going. So the target of our approach is port side alongside above the flight deck. Now if we reduce speed to around 60 knots, which gives us a 40 knots closure rate with the ship, and I'm descending with around 400 feet per second, which should bring me nicely alongside. As I get closer, I decelerate further, and I want to match the ship's 20 knots right next to the flight deck. Now I'm next to the flight deck, I am checking the ship if the landing area is alright. Yes, the fence is down. It's not rolling too much, and I'm moving over above the flight deck. Again, I stabilize, make sure I'm really into position above the flight deck where I want to touch down. I have to go to the left a little bit, and I can gently put her down. Alright guys, I hope you found this helpful. Till next time. Mm -hmm.